Kia ora, my name is John Minty. I'm director of New Zealand's Splore Music and Arts Festival. Uh, Splore started in New Year's 1998-99. Uh, it was inspired by some Kiwis that I used to uh, DJ in Goa and used to attend Burning Man. Splore is at Tapapakanga Park, which is about 70 kilometres southeast of Auckland. Um, it's been there since 2006. Uh, Tapapakanga is a traditional spiritual uh, land of mana whenua, ngati paua, ngati whanonga. It has uh, incredible history for the people there and also physically it is a spectacular spot on a beach with ancient pahutukawa trees. Explore tends to go for a very eclectic lineup. We don't stick to one genre. It, can, uh, it all comes down to how charismatic uh, and engaging performances. Um, but it generally hits a lot of the areas of soul, uh, hip hop, um, and electronica. First act I booked for Splore was Talib Kwali from Brooklyn. Uh, the ones that stand out for me would be probably Erica Badu in 2012, first time she'd been to New Zealand, uh, Rudimental a couple of years ago, and also last year, UK's Kate Tempest. Uh, Sprawl is quite unique because it's a multi-generational festival, so we have about 700 children on site under the age of 12, a lot of teenagers. Um, and people up to the age of 70. It's, it's a true multi-generational festival where we've had kids that have grown up at the festival and are now teenagers and young adults. Um, I think the key thing with Splore is very much the community uh, or ka our kaupapa that we've built up over the years. So it tends to be a, a very conscious, creative tribe of people that uh, acknowledge the environment they're in, have very sustainable outlooks on life and also have a caring attitude to diversity. I think the biggest challenges for a festival like Sproul, it's three or four days outside um, in late summer in New Zealand, which can have the occasional tropical cyclone coming down from the Pacific. So weather generally is the, the biggest challenge and we've had a number of years where we've had some very inclement weather in the build-up, um, but we've gone ahead regardless and, and embraced it.